So, you are up to anything. Wait, I say this calling me. Hey, Sonic. I am here to tell you about our recent success. Why would I care about your bad day business? The money is booming. Like, almost Bobex levels. I'm rich again! How? Hey, I didn't say that I'd pay you. Listen, the game show you did yesterday worked out brilliantly. If you want the money, you'll have to make another episode. My already earned money is all I'll need for the rest of my life anyways. I was actually thinking of doing another one anyway. This is... To perfect- Yeah. By the way, Sonic, I could real use beating a millionaire. You could give me a cut, right? Shut up, Tails! Yeah, I'm in! See you tomorrow! Well, actually, I'll be busy tomorrow. You'll have to set up the studio yourself. Ha, huh, you wish. Tails, you have a job to do! Well, uh, then you just have to pay me those million bucks. I'm fine! It's your lucky day! OMG, I'll finally be able to get a test. Well, see you all tomorrow then! Wait, who told you I was fine with this? What do you mean? You obviously always agree with me! The last game show caused the worst day of my life. Why would I be fine with this? Yeah, and who said I want to hold the microphone for you again? You never paid me. Well, hot. Um, That's it, I'm going home. Wait, no, there will be a prize this time! Prize? Uh, exactly, the one who wins this time will get a prize! What kind of prize? Oh, it's a surprise! This might be a really dumb move, but I guess I'm in. Yes! I was actually thinking of competing anyway. Looked fun last time, you know, not holding the mic. Yeah, sure, whatever, shut up, see you tomorrow. Shut up. Hey, Sonic. I did a bunch of work on the studio. You sure? Seems the same to me. Oh, I guess it's all on the inside. Automatic cameras, game boards, and a microphone stand. What? But I need an assistant! Yesterday Silver said that he will be competing in the game show. You know, not as an assistant. I also real wanted to participate. But if you real need an assistant, I guess I can fill in. Silver did do me a big favor. And I guess it would be fair anyway, since you're already paying me. Alright, sure. Glad to help. How are the invitations going? So, obviously I got Knuckles and Silver to agree yesterday. Sega is apparently away in a meeting, which is highly unlikely. Rouge has probably already started off the area to see where the treasure is. Hey, Rouge, I'm making another game show episode. And? Well, there will be a prize this time. Rouge? Mario said he was fine with going there if there was a bathroom installed. You did install one, right? Uh, no. But I can bring a portable toilet. Weird request. Poor and I must have had diarrhea. Anyways, the CEO of racism sounded ugly. Come. When I called him, he said he was always fine with hanging out. Hope I didn't call the wrong number. Oh, and I also called Shadow. He declined. Hey, Shadow, I'm inviting you to. To what? Please don't tell me that you want another trial. Sorry, you just slightly worked me up yesterday. No, you know what? This off. Was I really that harsh? I'm going to have to check in with the therapist about this. So yeah, more than I honestly expected. Hey, I'm curious. Where did you put the prize? Um, I won't tell you. Rouge could still be hiding out somewhere here. Done. Yeah, see, just as I expected, Rouge, go away! The game show is starting into ours! Huh? 15 minutes left and nobody has showed up yet. Well, excluding Rouge, of course. Hi. I'm ready to win. Or steal. Oh, wait! Look! There's someone coming! Oh! Oh, no! Sonic! How could you do this to me? Ah, uh, jeez. And who's this bitch? Amy, what did I tell you? You can't swear! Oh, sorry! It sometimes slips out! Anyways, how could you send me to the middle of nowhere right after marrying me? Oh, man! <laughs> In the period when Sonic couldn't perish anybody, 
His boredom completely took him over mentally. He was ready to do absolutely anything. That's why, when meeting Amy again, he finally accepted one of the countless proposals that she had done to him. Hey Sonic, what are you doing? I'm so bored. Well if you're so bored, why don't you just marry me? I'm uh, fine. Wait, what? At least it was something to do, everything happened going to plan. Until Sonic realized what he had just done. Sonic, I think you should start finding a job to provide for your upcoming family. Oh, but, but, but. In a moment of shock, he told Amy. Hey, uh, well, there's this new store that they're building, and uh, there's the portal to it. New store? We haven't had one in a while. And it has a fancy portal. Sign me up. She was sent to Minecraft. Damn, that narration was actually well timed. Thank you. I worked on it for a while. Sonic, you lied to me. There was no store there. I had to build one myself. Wait, what? How did you even get out of there? You were planning to leave me there. Kind of. So that's why the portal stopped working. I had to find another one. Well, that's not very nice. Hey, guys. Wait, didn't you say that you sent Amy to Minecraft? Yeah, thanks for making that portal and letting her escape, Knuckles. Oh? You should stop doing that anyway, Sonic. It's extremely dangerous. Yeah, whatever. Hey, what's happening here? Oh, uh, I'm making a game show. That sounds like fun. I'm in. Fine, as long as you completely forget the thing you were just mad about. Okay, so everyone is almost here. We're only waiting for it. The CEO of racism and Mario, the course, the worst of the bunch. Hey guys, sorry that I'm almost late. I had to sign off the last paperwork. Wait, since when do you have more than two voice lines? You mean that? Well, I've now retired from the position of the CEO of racism. What? Yeah, I was never really suited for the job anyways. I'm not actually racist. Dan, I'm gonna have to find a new arch nemesis. For the second time now. The paycheck was too good though. I couldn't pass over the chance. So you can now just call me by my name. Mega. But that's racist. It's close, but the spelling and pronunciation is slightly different. I'll call you. Mark, is everyone okay with that? Mark? I kind of like it. Thank you, Sonic. I don't think I'm ever gonna get used to this. Sonic, we're gonna have to air soon. But Mario hasn't arrived yet. I can't start with I am. I thought you despised him. Well, yeah, of course. The game show is about perishing the people I hate. Tails, I'm having second thoughts on having you as my show assistant. Okay, fine. We can wait a next minute. Okay, no serious. We're starting now. Wait, no! Um, hey, Doc. Hello, viewers, and welcome to the second episode of Is It Perishable, where a series of people fight for who gets to not be perished. This time in trivia form. My new assistant will explain the new rules. It's a me, a Mario. Uh. So, Sonic here will ask trivia questions to everyone competing, including this douchebag. Everyone will compete in tournament-style matchups, and after that is the grand finale, a fight for the win. So, what type of trivia? Well, the trivia questions will be about themselves. I repeat, themselves. Wait, so you lost questions about each other? Like, for example, you asked me what's Mario's favorite food? No. Sonic said that the questions will just be about the individual contestants. So, like, what's your favorite food? Where's the catch? Uh, no, that's it! If you answer incorrectly, I perish you! Wait, but then, this is gonna be the easiest game show ever. And best of all, there's a grand prize for the winner! Yeah, no, can we see it? Because you could just be lying about this. You have a tendency to do that. Well, yeah, no, that's ridiculous. Run the commercials, Tails. Wow, look at this cool battle. Oh, 
Come on! Look at this cool Sonic game! Who are you? Oh, thank God you answered. See that? I'm in a bit of a pickle right now. Can't. I'm in a meeting. Oh, shut up. You always tell me stuff like this when you're just sitting in your office and doing nothing. No, I'm serious this time. We're talking about how to make actually good games. I can't miss this. Wait, what? What's wrong with my games? Okay, listen. The meeting is gonna end in half an hour. Call me back Wait, then. Wait, no, I can't. Oh, damn. The commercial's above and soon, too. And we're back now. What was your question again? Whoa. Can we see the prize? No. Why not? Can't break the suspense. So, shall we start? Don't see why not. Then let's get to the show. Today, our contestants are the following. The no-repaired seal of racism. You can call me, Mark. The dumbass Mario. Let's off. Uh, oh, come on. My previous show assistant, Silver. Finally, I don't have to hold a microphone for an episode. The man on good terms with me again, Knuckles. We have never really been on good terms. The very scummy Twitch stream rouge. I will get that prize, even if I have to kill a man. And the barely my wet, Amy. Yay. Yeah, no, we're getting a divorce right after the game show. That is, if you come out in one piece, ha ha ha. What's a divorce? First round. The CEO of Racism vs. Mario. First question, what is your catchphrase? I'm pretty sure it's... Ha ha! Amazing! That's right, Mario! Let's and go. Uh, sorry, Buckle. Wrong answer. It's actually, I'm extremely dumb, I'm funny, and just in general, a horrible person. What? This is rigged? Yeah, Sonic is correct. That's your catchphrase. Huh. Second question, what is your profession? I was the CEO of racism for a long time, but now I've retired. I also have a medical degree. Oh, technically I wrote the answers before you announced this to me, so wrong. That's okay. I faced worse. No kidding, Mario. Arg. Dumb plumber? Nope, dumb Italian plumber. Now for the last question, what are you most known for? Being racist. Even though I'm not. That's right, which means Mario is out of the game. That's gotta hurt, but not as much as me perishing you. Ha 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 Can I go to the bathroom? Oh, okay. It's outside. You pee. I'm pretty sure he just escaped. So where? We live in a white void anyway. Um, great point. Hee <laughs> hee. I'll tell you where. I'll just go back to the Mushroom Kingdom through the toilet pipe. Looks like I've outsmarted you, as usual. I give up. That's it. I'm done. Just do it. Then that was quick. Quicker than me on the toilet. Well, bye, I guess. Um, I guess he real had diarrhea. On to the second round. Second round. Knuckles oh. versus Silver. That thing is loud. Anyways, for your first question, what is your special ability? Enhanced strength, climbing and gliding. Oh, and some emerald sensing stuff or whatever. Correct. Silver. Telekinesis, obviously. Ah, uh, wrong answer. It's apparently psychokinesis. I can't believe this. This whole life I've been lied to. Save it for later. We gotta move on. Second question. What color are you? Right. Is this some kind of trip question? Nope. You are correct. Silver. Gray, I guess. Silver. Your name is Silver. That's because you're colored silver. Ah. Oh. Darn. This means you're out plenty. Any last words? At least I didn't have to hold the microphone. Wait, exclamation. Take me instead. What? Spare him. I'll take his place, exclamation. Tails, I appreciate it, but the rules are the rules. Besides, getting perished is not that bad. You'll just reappear the next episode somehow. True. I've been perished more than enough times. Also, I still need an assistant, you know? But... Sonic, just do it already, everyone's waiting. Wait. I'm getting mixed feelings right now. I need time to process this. Sounds like a good excuse for a commercial break. Have you ever had to take someone out? Legally. Introducing your personal legal hitman Sonic. Nah, you might think, how is this possible? We utilize only the finest forms of black magic and send them to the hellhole called the Minecraft Dimension. Look at all of those blocks. 
Hey, only 39, 90 might a month and have your victims who fool away permanently, never to be seen again. And if you don't pay, maybe you will never be seen again. Prime show is on sale, monthly pay permanent, portal removal separate, no refunds. And while Third back, round. Amy versus Rouge. Hails, time it correctly next time. First question, what is your favorite activity, Amy? Helping people, I guess. And... Oh yeah, and always obsessing over you. And you almost forgot that. Yes, that's correct, Rouge. Easy, exploiting people for personal gain. Just like I'm gonna do with you. Spot on. And nope, I'll make sure you don't exploit me. Yeah! Second question, what's your weapon of choice? Comically large hammer, of course! Yeah, correct! And it always magically appears out of thin air when you need it, Rouge! Sticky bombs. Correct! You could possibly blow up the place right now! Yeah, as a backup plan. And as I worry about my security more and more, we finally move on to the deciding third question. What's your body count, Amy? 30,678. Yeah, around 31k. I knew it. You were not terrible. Whoa, 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 calm down. Maybe there's a simple explanation for this. Amy, what is the definition of body count? Um, anything you've put to rest, right? You mean anyone? Anything. Bugs deserve today. Phew. That's not the definition. It's how many people you've put to rest. Whoa. Well, then, Zura, apparently. Yeah, that's what I thought. Roosh. Well then, Roosh, do you forfeit? Hell no. Zero. Yeah, was surprised to see this one on Google, so-called spot. While menacing and all, threatening me and so on, hasn't even murdered a person. Sonic, are you mocking somebody for not committing murder? Ah, let's get back on topic. Correct. Ah, uh, oh wait, you both got all three questions right. Yup. Kales, what do we do? Uh. Rematch, I guess. Yes, you two are quite the fighters. You're having a rematch in the semi-finals. Let's take a bit of time to cool off now, then run the commercials. Yes? Ah, oh, thank God. See that? I have a few minutes to talk. The meeting is not done yet. It's gonna be a bit longer. I'm having a bit of trouble with some of the tasks here. Okay, whatever. Get something is the press. I don't care what. Get something or I'm done. Okay, fine. See you. Phew. That bad girl's body count might be zero, but she could do just about anything for some cash. And we're back. Welcome to... The semi-finals. Fourth round. The CEO of Racism vs. Knuckles. First question. How racist are you? Well, I was literally the CEO of Racism, so I presume the right answer is... Overwhelmingly! What? How did you know the exact adjective I used? I thought this was a tricky one, correct? Perhaps I know you too well. Yeah, yeah, Knuckles. Not a bit. Being racist is dumb. What about that racism deluxe you keep talking about? Bingo, oh, Kales, what about that? That's it, I can't keep hiding this. This game franchise is absolutely the best I've ever seen. Your games can't even compare to them, Sonic. Whilst the main protagonist is incredibly racist, you see these life choices absolutely ruin his life. If anything, the game is actively pushing an anti-racism message. <laughs> I appreciate you liking my projects. And serve as the CEO. I had full freedom over the games. All I had to do is call the game racism. And nobody in the company would even notice that I was discouraging racism. I didn't know you make them. Wait, so is it okay to like the games? Absolutely. Oh, thank God. I thought I was acting exactly like my worst enemy was. You also play racism. Hell yeah. Love the plot of racism adventure too. Mark, was it? You are extremely talented at what you do. Your games are absolute masterpieces. Thank you. Thank you. Anyways, the answer is still wrong, Knuckles. What? Hey, if I could change the correct answers, the seal of racism. Well, Mark wouldn't have to keep pretending to be racist. Yeah, yeah, of course, you can't just count it as a point, of course. Second question, how do you make your cereal? How did you even figure this one out? As a cereal eater, I am my waste. Milk first, cereal after. Correct, wait, but, your liquid is milk, I eat it with my G-Fuel. 
Did you just say you eat your cereal with G Fuel? Yeah, I told you that last thing show. Don't you remember? I put that liquid after. What? Dude, you fell off. Nobody with the same mind would put liquid after. Now I have to check in with the doctor. Third question. Where do you come from? Easy. Angel Island. Very true, Mark. I'm a very distant relative of Dr. Eggman from about 200 years in the future. And I reside in this other dimension. It's when I first met you. Now, granted, previously I tried to destroy your world. But the one thing I really hated is to now. What the hell? I thought you were Eggman's father. How much do you remember from before the incident? It's becoming more clear and clear that I don't remember much. Anyways, incorrect, you're up. Well, I'm pretty much used to this. So, yeah, one last time. Make it great. God damn it. What is up with you people today? How am I getting consensual perishing here? I guess by Mark. Doesn't feel right anymore after he is retired. Yeah, like perishing could never feel right. Ha 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 ha. Finals once again. Just don't do what you did last time and everything will be okay. Fifth round. Amy versus Rudri match. First question. What's a birth defect you have? Colorblindness. Correct. And no kidding. That's why you always get people confused with me. Yes. You can't blame me now, can you? I can and I will. Rouge. I have very floppy ears. I am very embarrassed about this. Hey, hey, it's fine, they just got a little excited with the jiggle physics, that's all. Heck, at least everything is not super stiff on you like everyone else. Don't patronize me. My body count can go to one any second, you know. Oh, uh, yes, anyways, that was correct. Second question, what was an activity you did a long time ago of? I played with my tarot cards. I only really stopped because there's no card manufacturer here, and I didn't really bring them with me. Yeah, correct. I was a government spy. That's where I got my skills. Trick! Why you stop? Well, this Twitch thing is somehow paying way better than any of my work with the government. Of course, why did I even ask? Well, aren't you both tough? Three question round again! Just, don't die again! I will not know what to do then! Third question! Ah! Um, can you do my laundry? This is definitely a trivy question. Shut up! No. God damn it! Why did you have to answer correctly, Amy? Of course, anytime. I would do everything for you, Sonic. Yeah, you wish. You're never touching my laundry. Not a single sock. Wrong. What? Why? Listen, I'm just glad I have a reason to perish you. Until you inevitably come back next episode. You know what? I think my powers are heavily overrated. Anyways, bye. Velp, I clearly saw double standards here, but who am I to care? I just want the prize. So yeah, the finale is coming to you after you guessed it, a commercial break. You surely heard of my new Have you ever had a Sonic problem? Like you can't get away from Sonic. Have you ever had this situation? Jesse, what are you doing? Yo, I'm playing Sonic 06. Jesse, don't you know Sonic 06 only has a Metacritic score of 46? Mr. White. That's just the opinion of a random game journalist. It can't dictate what I like about the game. I can have my own opinions, bitch. That's a lot of bullshit, Jesse. I'm going to delete Sonic 06 from your Xbox. No, bitch, you can't do that, Mr. White. Jesse, time to play a real game like Halo. Guess what, Mr. White? I'm going to burn down your Cortana body pillow. situation you should buy anti-sonic spray you can only know sonic repellent get yours today for only 199 that's just the price of a timber to get your own anti-sonic spray go to the website or the link below we could leave the lights on sun tan. did they make a spray against me tails what the hell happened the broadcast was cut off by some again Character. Ah, fine, it's too late now, bro. Back to the game show. Let's finish this.
after that. Still, amazing commercial break, we move on to the finale. The fight for the win. So, we're not giving you any weapons, physical strength only. Wait, what's going on? The fight for the win. You know, you both fight. Well, I thought this was a game show. Not some barbaric death match in a full on arena. I'm fine with this. When can we start, Sonic? Wait, no, I forfeit. God! God damn it, why did I think this could work out? Knuckles, I need a finale here. I'm sorry, but I forfeit, okay? Give the prize to Rouge again, I just don't want history to repeat itself. Sonic, this deathmatch thing is not going well. We're losing numbers. Egg! Fine! Knuckles, you can forfeit! Alright. So, where's my money? But bum I'll be right back! Well, looks like I'm gonna have to find another way to threaten him. Sagan, where are you? I need you ASAP! Wait, I'm almost there. No, you have to! You have to get here now or I'm done! No more money from me! God damn it! Now she's bombing the place! See that I know where did you go at? Everyone. See that? Pay! Bum! Ah yes! The prize is here with a boat, everybody! So, um, I'll start with the participation trophies. Ah! Uh, Sega actually did something more than the bare minimum! Oh, uh, Everyone gets my new game! Oh, uh, what is this? Monkey Ball! I thought you were working on my new games! Well, um, I put you in as a playable character- Get me that now! So, who won? Me. Once again. Now actually getting my well-deserved prize. Here. Got a little box for it too. It's five bucks. You can buy a drink with that, or something. Or some Sonic anti-spray. Oh man. Hell yeah, worth it. All I had to do is nab this book or whatever. Yeah, no, I'm done. I'm done. Everyone pack up and leave. I need a break. Well, can everyone agree that that was fun? Yeah. Possibly getting stranded in the middle of nowhere again does equal fun. I wish I could have competed, but I guess paying me off with one million dollars is better. Yay, glad you agree with me. Can't wait for the next episode. Hey, Sonic, I don't recall. Did you put out the fire in the studio? No way. Oh! Yup. Leaking gasoline from the car next to uncontained fire doesn't end up well. Yeah, suck it game show. So, Sonic, when am I gonna get my million bucks? You know, I don't have the money yet! Shut up! Ha, huh, you wish.